guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is on this look right here. This was actually requested a couple videos back. Um, someone had requested that I do an orange look and a pink look. And uh, you guys already have seen the orange look, so here is the pink one. I'm not confident in pink eyeshadows at all whatsoever, but I feel pretty confident with this look right here. I really like how it turned out. So if you guys want to see how I got this look, then keep on watching. Alright, so my face is already done. Please don't mind my left eyebrow. I plucked it way too short the other day, so I've been having to like fill it in differently. And sometimes I feel like it looks natural, and then other times I feel like it looks noticeable. But we're just gonna roll with it. Alright, so for primer today, I'm going to use like two different products, and you'll see why as I explain. So first I'm going to start off with my NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Milk. And I'm really just going to put this on like the inner half, third maybe of the eye. But I'm going to really focus it where the inner corner is because I'm going to take a brush to blend it out. So then I'm just going to take this Wet n Wild brush and kind of bring it like that. And then I'm just going to leave that there and move on to the rest of my eye. And then after, I'm going to go in with my Urban Decay Primer Potion, but I'll show you how to do that once we get there. Alright, so I have no pink eyeshadow. I don't really know why. Pink's just not really my color of eyeshadow. But I'm going to make do with what I have, and I'm going to go in with this Lorac Pro to Go palette. I'm going to be using the blush, the pink one. And then I'm just going to take this little eyeshadow brush from BH Cosmetics and pat this on where we applied the um, NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil. And be really super careful because this does have some fallout. What you're going to want to do is really focus most of the color on like the inner corner and then kind of feather it out as you go. Alright, next up we're going to add this Urban Decay Primer Potion, and I'm really just actually going to go in with my pinky and add this where we did not put any of that uh, NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil, and I'm really just taking like the tiniest amount. Next to start the crease, I'm going to go in with the Tarte Tartlet Palette, and I'm just going to take the color Force of Nature and just sweep this all in the crease. Then I'm going to go in with this Sigma E25 brush and I'm going to pick up Wanderer and Force of Nature on the same brush and put this all on the crease. Next up with this Dome brush, I'm going to go in with Force of Nature, Wanderer, and a little bit of Dreamer. And really just focus this on the outer V and kind of where I didn't apply any shadow and just put the um, primer potion. Then I'm just going to take a little bit of multitasker and really just focus this on the outer V. And I'm just going to use this to kind of deepen it up a little bit. Then I'm just going to take this clean fluffy blending brush just to blend everything together. So I just want to kind of like smoke out the lower lash line so I'm just going to go in with all the colors that we used on the crease with a pencil brush so I'm going to put Force of Nature, Wanderer, Dreamer and Multitasker. So I did my mascara and my eyeliner off camera. Eyeliner I've been doing off camera because when I feel I feel like when I film it, 
I mess up and I just feel pressure to like get it perfect. I don't know what it is. And I just concentrate better when I'm doing it off camera. And I just use the Maybelline Eye Studio Gel Eyeliner. And I just did my mascara off camera just to save some time. And it's just very repetitive because I use the same ones all the time. But I'll tell you guys what ones I use if you are curious. I use the Benefit Bad Gal Lash. The Maybelline La Lash Sensational um, Luscious Full Fan Effects. The Elf... Voluminous mascara. I think that's what it's called. Name will be listed down below in the description box. And my Maybelline Great Lash, lots of lashes. So next, I just want to add this white eyeliner in my waterline. I want to add it after my mascara because I tend to get the mascara on my waterline somehow. Don't ask how. I'm like a wild woman when I do my mascara. So I want to add this so it's just nice and white and bright in my waterline. I'm gonna go in with my Too Faced Chocolate Bomb Bomb Palette and this Sonia Kashuk pencil brush and I'm gonna go in with the color Sprinkles which is this really pretty light pink color and I'm gonna pop this in the inner corner just as a highlight. Lips today I just want to use a gloss because the eyes are pretty matte so I'm gonna use this NYX Butter Gloss in Meringue. That is it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did just give it a big thumbs up and if you have not already hit that red button down below to subscribe to my channel it would mean the world to me if you subscribed follow me on all my social media that's always linked down below as well you guys should definitely follow me on twitter i'm really active there and subscribe to my vlog channel i am really active on there too and if you like vlogs you should totally subscribe if you guys have any video suggestions leave those in the comments and if you just want to leave a comment saying, hey, I would love that also. And that is all I have to say. So I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.